But while you're out here at the fair riding all the rides, I'll bet the last thing you think about is going to the library. But once you finally decide to go to the library, things might start to look a little different when you're looking for those books. Tara Prindeville has the story. I started reading at a very young age. I was two years old. Mike Maisie has been coming to the library for as long as he can remember. So I was going to the library when I was two, three years old. Now 67, Maisie has been a frequent visitor ever since, going to the library four to five times a week. I, I love the atmosphere, I love the library, I love to be able to put my hand on a book or a DVD or things like that, different kinds of media and use it. But among the rows upon rows of books at the Sun City Library, Maisie's noticed a major change. The Dewey Decimal System is gone. The new system uses words instead of numbers. Instead of a number like 641.5 for a mystery novel, now it just says mystery. Harry Courtright developed the new Dewey List system. He says the public simply couldn't find the books they wanted. We have this wonderful Dewey Decimal system which librarians understand and the public don't have a clue. Courtright says the new system is more user friendly. Maisie agrees and hopes this will spur more people to come to the library. All the knowledge is in this library but it's doing nothing. The only way it can be doing something is somebody come in here and use it. Maisie says anyone looking to learn can trust the new system will help them do just that. In Phoenix, Tara Prindeville, Cronkite News. You know, I always thought those numbers were confusing anyway. I'll have to check it out.